Well, hello everyone. This is Neil Arnhart, and I'm here to bring you today's edition of Neil Arnhart's Daily Dingleberry Awards. Today we're going to give our award to the head of the DNC, a man by the name of Tim Kaine. Now, the reason that Tim Kaine is getting his well-earned dingleberry has to do with the way that he took a political opponent's statement and made it be completely the opposite of what the um, person meant to say. Now, what I'm referring to, um, several days ago, President Obama said that he would keep his boot heel on the throat of British Petroleum, and Rand Paul thought that that was an un-American way for the president to express himself. Now, personally, I don't know if an American is the right word. It's, it's you know, kind of unpresidential, and I wish the president hadn't put it that way, but Rand Paul thought it was un-American, and he did so. Now, he did not say that um, the United States should not keep pressure on British Petroleum. He just said that he didn't like the rhetoric, that that was a bad way for the president to put it. But when Tim Kaine was talking with Chris Wallace on the news on Sunday, wouldn't you know it, Tim Kaine comes right out and says, Rand Paul does not think the United States should hold British Petroleum accountable. I don't know where he gets this. You know, now Chris Wallace corrected him. He says, now, to be fair, Mr. Kaine, you know, Rand Paul was talking about the rhetoric, you know, and, and not the intention of keeping... Uh, a British Petroleum Accountable, you know, words to that effect. But, you know, he made his point. It's like the uh, in the courtroom when the uh, lawyer uh, gets somebody to blurt something out that he knows is the judge is going to have stricken from the record, but somebody in the jury is going to remember it. Well, if he repeats that often enough, he's going to have people out there saying, Rand Paul does not want the government to hold British Petroleum accountable for their screw-up. Tell the truth, Mr. Kane. I mean, that's all there is to it. You don't, you don't have to make up stuff. There's plenty of legitimate differences between your party and Rand Paul's positions that you can find something true to, uh, to uh, um, you know, try to make points with. You don't have to make up stuff, and making up stuff makes you a dingleberry, and your award is on the way. This is Neil Arnhart with Neil Arnhart's Daily Dingleberry Award Show, signing off.